Lixen. Ween. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, hey. Become romantic. Oh my god. <laughs> it looks like a little worm, though. It's so adorable. Like a little fat worm. They really like each other, don't they? <laughs> All right. <laughs> that thing squirted from two ends over there. I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, yeah, previously on Bowie. So last time we got a job, yay me. We also met a few guys and girls, one of which is Jokin Lechin. He seems like a great dude, funny, he loves dancing. We didn't really have much romantic interest, but I feel like he could be a great friend though. On another note, I met this poor fellow. They go by the name Sammy, aka the Ring Bear. I would like to see what's under that costume, maybe you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But the dude's sad about a lost ring. Kind of feel sorry for him. Hopefully I can take on the quest to help a bear out. And the other very strange thing that happened is that this beautiful lady called us. She said that we have been selected for the Seven Wild Dates romance-based reality show. I do not know what that's about. Well, we, I mean, I do know what it's about. We have to date Seven Sims and, you know, we'll see how that pans out. But hello, everybody. Welcome to part two of playing Love Struck. You know, I am seriously enjoying this expansion i mean the first part we didn't really do much i mean we did meet a lot of people including the ring bear and we got signed up for this reality show thing oh my god are we supposed to date agnes <gasps> oh okay no she's still under garden shop owner which calms me down just a little bit you know i, I was about to think that we were supposed to date agnes you know i, I just want to see what she wants though i'm just gonna invite her in anyway so we did meet the ring bear i really want to go on that quest to help the ring bear because um he's sad and i'm wondering if he might change his outfit as soon as you give the ring to him like i am not gonna be watching anyone's videos in terms of that freaking ring bear i want to see for my own eyes what's gonna happen there okay when we helped him out so anyway our friend jokin is still here he's doing some lovely push-ups in the kitchen <laughs> love that for him so agnes um hi are you supposed to be my date no i, I trust not <laughs> yeah i don't know a lot of social bunny were thinking nobody cares about social bunny this this is love struck. We're focusing on keep its corner, which is actually a good idea to go check out. Hey, Jokin, scooch. I want to use this real quick, all right? I wonder if you can actually open keep its corner on your phone. I believe that's, yeah, that's faster. You can, which is cool. Okay, Jokin, it's okay. You can stay on the laptop. Okay, so in terms of matches, let's refresh this real quick. So a little birdie told me that this whole keep its corner thing is actually also based on the gallery. So hopefully we can ooh, find some cool looking people here. Why are you here? Aren't Aren't you married, sweetie? Carrie, Miko. Oh, here's that girl from San Marcino. And here's Marco. Oh, and this girl. Oh my gosh, this is Penny Bazaar. Are you serious? Like, okay. Between these guys, I suppose we can have him as date number one of seven. Yeah, we're supposed to be dating seven guys, apparently. So let's maybe ask to create a date with this dude. Poor Jokin. He looks a little bit angry now. Oh, okay. You're just leaving now? I'm so sorry that I did I hurt you? I'm so sorry. Yeah, so this is supposed to be a romantic date, am I right? We're gonna be focusing on being romantic. I don't know if we're gonna who, but we can try. We can do physical intimacy. We can socialize and be friendly. We can do some dancing. And maybe something totally random. How about singing? Okay, where would I like the date to be? Maybe in a karaoke lounge or a karaoke bar? Yeah, Planet Honey Pop is literally the best freaking lounge there is to do anything karaoke related. Oh, but there's no place to woohoo there, is there? No, I don't think so. We could maybe put in a little something sneaky there for that interaction. So, hey, your name is Jesse Calvert. You're pretty cool looking. Oh, shoot, not a good idea to embrace as a first interaction, Bowie. I don't know if we're actually gonna date Seven Sims. It seems like a little bit too much. But I mean, we could execute that, you know, but I'm just not sure if we're gonna do all of those Well, that sounded bad <laughs> Do all of those sims in one episode, you know, all right So let's maybe grab a serving together and then we can start socializing. Let's start off by being friendly Let's see compliments. Let's support his facial hair. I like supporting facial hair so manly and I love it Oh, you don't like that? I am so sorry, dude Okay, dude, if you didn't like it, then why do you have facial hair? 
facial hair it like just doesn't make sense you know i'm just supporting it you know i think he wants me to support something else if you ask me let's maybe try singing together sing a duet country with <gasps> i really want to meet him i i want to meet akira i really want him to be one of our dates um oh and this guy he's, he's He's pretty gorgeous. Okay, so let's sing together. And I really want to meet you before you go anywhere. Where's the Sulanian guy now? I really want him in our context as well. Don't see him right now. No, girl, you're a little bit rusty. Oh, no, he's good though, at least. Talk about dancing. You know, why would we talk about dancing if we could just dance? You know? Okay, let's talk about dancing then. You know, that's what the date panel wants. So we'll do what the date panel... Oh, hey. You're getting a little bit too close for comfort, sweetie. Um, let's go to the toilet real quick. Oh my god. I'm... I'm officially in love. <laughs> uh, okay, if you guys could see my face now, you would totally be thinking to yourself like, Dude, it's a sim. Calm down. <laughs> Why are these toilets... Oh, it's, it's not broken. I thought they were broken for a minute there. We're gonna use the squirty toilets. Oh, you're gonna fall asleep from energy failure. Beautiful. <sighs> okay, this is horrifying. And this is not a good idea, but we should maybe try and nap a little bit. Hopefully our date doesn't mind. I'm so sorry that I'm sleeping right now like this. This is this is horrible. I don't even know what I'm doing here, if I have to be honest. Yeah, I'm sorry, dude. I'm, I'm sorry. Like I, I chose a bad time for the date and everything like it's totally my fault Um, but you know what if you can't respect the girl sleeping then you don't deserve her on her wedding day Okay, if that makes any sense. Oh my god. No, no, wait, 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 extend the date We lost a lot of time sleeping on the sofa over there. I'm sorry not He doesn't want to extend the date like that is so rude complain about the cloudy weather I don't know. Oh my god. Like I don't think he likes us that much I mean he would have said yes to extending the date I suppose we can actually just end this date because it's not going well anyway All right, so we have one date behind our backs beautiful. Okay, let's go home get our needs up and try I don't know maybe Akira one down six to go then all right, so let's go to bed maybe first yeah let's do this let's go to sleep maybe we can actually try and execute the next date at home i wonder how that will go maybe we will get some kind of notification telling us okay cool i see you're busy with your first date <gasps> why did i just cancel that oh that's so stupid hey <gasps> okay 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 wait seems like joking is gonna be our second date then okay i think it's a good idea luckily our sleep need is full enough all we need to do is go to a bathroom and get something to eat and then we will be fine but what will the requirements be to you know successfully doing the date i don't know seems like we have none all right okay okay sorry sorry sorry, sorry. go to a bathroom and what are we doing in glimmerbrook like why in glimmerbrook this is such a boring bar but okay all right joke in my friend oh I thought you guys had bad chemistry and stuff. Like, seems like you're doing well. I'm very happy to see that. Um, Nancy and Jeff over there. Let's maybe kiss his hands just to be funny. I don't know if we're gonna be serious with him in any way. The thing is, I just don't want to break his heart because he really is a good friend so far. You look like you're having a good time oh that's so sweet this date just keeps getting better okay well seems like i'm having a better date with you than with the other guy what was his face jesse yeah let's compliment his appearance be friendly talk about hobbies we could throw in a sexy pose over there complain about wind wind do we have wind at the moment yeah we have strong wind oh that's cool offer seductive dance oh you can offer a dance a seductive dance to a sim how is that gonna work excuse me no 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 no. i really want to see that interaction she offering a dance to him sounds very you know sensual okay they're both doing the seductive dance not just one of them but okay <laughs> you go girl you go girl Ooh. You do that strut girl. Ooh. <laughs> I love these dance moves. It's just so freaking quirky. It's so nice to be with someone I can talk to for hours. I'm so glad you think that way, Joe Quinn. Like, you are actually 
a very good friend. And I must say, um, we are kind of romantically attracted to you. So I think we can just show him that, you know, to compliment his appearance. But okay, it seems like our date is ending. I think for the next sim, we can go for a Kira. But first I would like to order some food here for us to enjoy, share maybe. Thanks for a great date. Oh my gosh. I I appreciate that joke. Are you going? Are, are you going now? All right. I'll see you again. I just really want to eat something before heading home. I think it's a good idea. And those two lovebirds are still at it back there in, on the balcony. <gasps> I didn't know you can stargaze or cloud gaze on a, on a seat now. That's so cool. Hey, look, there's Judith Ward. Is she going to be in every episode? Like, she was in the previous episode. And I feel like she's going to be in each and every episode that we're going to do on Love Struck. We have five simoleons. Oh, no, girl. I think it's time to make a little bit of money. Like, that's that's very important, too not just the dating thing oh look how beautiful this icon is of the world i don't and i actually don't know maybe the preview icon of the world i don't know but this is kind of pretty i don't i think it was butterflies that flew out there just a minute oh that was so cool i'm still waiting on you guys' opinions on what we're actually gonna do with our house you know are we gonna move into one of those fancy penthouses or are we gonna convert our house into a bigger house or convert our house into a three or four unit apartment in which we can live in one of the apartments like let me know what you think on that and we have a gnome i'm gonna sell you is that okay oh here's another one sell it who are you ah uh, hector lawrence why are you in our house this is a little bit weird and out of line we have another one for 51 bucks that we can sell well we have a little bit of money now i'm very happy about that it's actually all i wanted to do but aside from that i just really want to go to sleep because i really want to oh no we're not doing benny again but what do you want remember when we talked about vanessa jo N dude we didn't talk at all i gave you one funny interaction and you just blew us off so yeah i'm not interested in anything benny has to say screw that guy hey i heard you became friends with joe quinn yeah he is pretty cool he's a good friend we're a little bit attracted to him but you know many friends are attracted to their friends i suppose i really wonder what this hotel is all about should we actually check it out rent a room to sleep you know what i'll check that out when we have a date all right which will be right now i'm gonna ask akira to come over let's ask on on a date and we're gonna have the date here at home all right romantic date of course we are gonna be focusing on being romantic being friendly potentially do a little bit of a woo here and you know what i think that's all we're gonna do okay sweetie get into something seductive where are you are you coming oh my god he's coming upstairs oh, jesus help me Let's kiss his hand. Okay, no, whoa, 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 Bowie. You're going too fast. I know he's cute, but it doesn't mean he's just gonna fall for our tricks, okay? Let's give him relationship advice. You know, I don't I don't know. Damn, we're we're screwing up already. Let's support his facial hair. Let's see if he appreciates us supporting his freaking facial hair. Um let's maybe flirt, you know, jump straight to the bed. I really wanna get to know this guy a little bit more because <laughs> I mean who doesn't? Flirtation, let's do a pickup line, let's maybe offer him a rose and why would we talk about who who when we can actually just do it you know like that's just weird <laughs> like rather say woohoo than talking about it let's ask about woohoo interest sure i really i would actually like to know that where are you going and i also want to extend this date oh he likes the rose <gasps> oh was that our first kiss with none other than Akira Kibo. Am I? I'm wiping my eyes out. Did that just actually happen? Am I doing this right? Oh my god, that's so cute, actually. It's too sexy pose, maybe. Are we? Well, that didn't really count as a kiss, did it? So I think we gotta do this right. Right? Oh my god, I'm, I, I'm crazy for these two right now. Oh. Oh my god, that was gorgeous. Oh, I'm like a freaking teenager. I'm sorry. Um, can we do that again? I just want to see that interaction again. No, okay. <gasps> you know what, Akira? I would really like to check out this hotel over here, whatever this is. Motel, hotel. <gasps> Ooh, let's do this. Oh my god. I know we're jumping straight into the hole of the devil's tangos, but you know, it's okay. This is what our dates are about. But we have nothing really going on here yet. Like, why not? Ooh, shiny. Oh, hello. The whole place lights up and... Oh, <laughs> that's so cool. What the frick? <laughs> Whoa, this is... 
I see. Oh my gosh, he's our first kiss and our first woohoo. I gotta write that down. Just so I don't forget, you know. Because I tend to. Alright, let's go to my place again, Akira. <gasps> I really, really, really wanna buy something. And that something is gonna be the freaking adorable picnic mat blankets, whatever. Oh, we can do this one as well. Let's go with this plainish one. The red. Oh my gosh, the red. <laughs> okay, you know, it's just a red freaking blanket. What am I on about? I think they organized their own picnic bask. Okay, this clips. Okay, but okay, hold on. Why didn't Love Struck come with its own picnic basket then? Or am I blind? Didn't it come with its own picnic basket? You know, it's actually kind of sad if it didn't, but I don't see any picnic basket from Love Struck at all. All right, so let's go and watch the stars. Go watch the stars. Oh, you guys are so cute, honestly. <gasps> oh my gosh. I just I just really want to take a, a, a screenshot over here. Like, I think they are an absolute hot match, if you know what I mean. Like, oh my god. And they both are, like, kind of into this leather look. Oh, oh my gosh. I just... I, I can't. I just can't. Okay, let's woohoo again. <laughs> I know we just did it, but... Wait! Extend the date. Extend it. I think this whole night is gonna be based on the Akira date, you know? I think I like the idea of that. What am I talking about? Think I love the idea of that. All right. Okay. So the date has been extended. Let's do. Okay. This is also gonna be my first time seeing this woohoo interaction over here. Would you describe the romance between Bowie and Akira as being? Yes. It's definitely giving steamy. You know. Oh, isn't it the same thing? Yeah. Yeah. We're steamy. Okay. Oh, hey. Become romantic. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> um. Akira is sort of falling for Bowie and wants to ask her if she would like a relationship. Do you want this to happen? You know, we are busy dating different guys, getting to know different guys. It's gonna be very heartbreaking to do this, but not right now. Okay, we're testing our options, if I can put it that way, all right? Look at this. Oh, what? Ah! <laughs> okay, it looks like a little worm though. It's so adorable like a little fat worm. Oh my gosh Okay, you know a worm from a different galaxy. Maybe like this is just extraterrestrial right here <laughs> Okay, all right. Are you guys uh, are you guys done? You, you guys finished? Okay, one of these nights now, you know Christmas is also on its way Um, They really like each other don't they? <laughs> all right <laughs> Oh my god, that thing squirted from two ends over there. I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, um, yeah. Okay, we need to do more of these things. Dang, okay, small talk. Why should we small talk? That is so boring. I want to do some more picnic basket interaction. Ask about romantic boundaries. Explain attraction level. Ask for attraction level. Ask about romantic status. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm feeling very satisfied in our relationship. Me too. <laughs> Am I doing this right though? I, I just want to be a little bit socially awkward because that is what we are at the end of the day. Like, am I am I doing this right? Oh, she seems so unsure about herself. The poor thing. Why did you move so close to us all of a sudden, Akira? Like, oh my gosh. Oh, he gave us a hug out of his own. Not so sweet. Okay, let's do this again. Date? No. Friendly? Small talk. Confess to being socially awkward. I feel like you should know that. Oh, you can even create a custom relationship label that's that's cool um what was what were we supposed to do ah uh, you're going to bed how much time do we have left three hours yeah i think kira okay he's down here everybody's using my freaking laptop by the way so yeah you know girl i kind of understand why you're tired i mean i would be too <laughs> in a way <laughs> why am i so fucking cringy sometimes i don't know um i just guess it's the way i am you know this girl looks freaking cool i know she's you know towny dressed but pretty cool nonetheless bowie you are rested enough Shall we extend this woo- I mean, this woo-hoo? Oh my god. Shall we extend this date, maybe? I think that's a good idea. Because we lost a little bit of time sleeping now. Whisper about desires. Ooh. More time for rendezvous. The event timer has been extended. Lovely. Bowie and Akira are very satisfied in their relationship. While in this state, romantic relationship will slowly increase. Okay, but wait. While in this state, the romantic relationship will slowly increase 
decrease over time automatically like isn't supposed to say decrease because it can decrease i'm not sure if i'm understanding this correctly i think i'm not bowie is in freaking bed again beautiful okay so we really want to woohoo again apparently so let's go ahead and do that for the third time now woohoo <gasps> i can do or not do but i can see the um the cuddle animation now like we're definitely gonna do this with akira i mean we need to sleep anyways i think this is also where i'm gonna leave this date for now things are getting too steamy in this date and i, f I feel like youtube is gonna be mad at me for showing that all the time you done nope oh my god <laughs> done yeah beautiful oh my god you filthy girl no go take a wee take a shower what did you just do in the shower akira you cool dude ah we fell asleep somewhere again i really just want to see this interaction like i'm not gonna leave this date until well that, that's good enough <laughs> i just want to see that interaction before really ending the date you know oh we got some candles as a gift or a reward at least beautiful i just wanna i just wanna you know see this oh my god oh this is so cute oh this 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 right here is gold i love that the sims 4 added this i mean the last time i saw sims cuddle like this was in the sims 2 like you you saw it rarely happening but you would see it now and then that's so cute can we go to sleep this way oh no okay let's go oh but i wish it was us laying in his arms you know but anyway we have to start getting around to our fourth date no, maybe we can actually finish all of these dates in one episode. And I don't know if it's actually counting as dates if we date in other locations. But yeah. Okay, Akira, go home. Bye. Pretend you're asleep so that he doesn't need to really say goodbye, you know, wake you up and everything. Um, hey, Boreal. No, I don't want to be a garden gnome. I'm a human being. <laughs> well, that was a beautiful date. You know, let's make some eggs and toast. Wake up at a normal time this time. I can't believe we had our first kiss on our third date like i actually thought jokun would be our first kiss but it's not you know tea spice this is what this let's play is gonna be all about um so this blankie can stay <gasps> where is jeff where's joffrey or jeffrey whatever the freak his name is i don't want to cuddle with him oh this is a nice lot to build maybe a trailer park <gasps> i'm having ideas i'm sorry um let's just go away from that one for now so next date oh cupid's corn pause oh no 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 it's that guy what's happening over there oh oh okay interesting that's that guy from glimmerbrook i don't like him i don't like his purple eyes it puts me off a little bit let's go on to keep it corner go on a blind date are we gonna do a blind date oh my gosh maybe 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 yeah clean your dishes all right blind date let's go all right um i'm just for now gonna be focusing on being romantic and being friendly because we don't know this person okay oh we need at least three activities okay um, i don't know board games there are usually board games there in places like these all right oh i almost thought this is the sim we're dating is it you hello your name is jude davidson okay i like i love your first name that's pretty awesome um yeah okay let's socialize get to know them uh let's do a romantic introduction let's see how he reacts to that we he can i think they like it oh they love it okay great hey you can leave akira kibo out of your mouth woman um let's be funny let's do potty no let's do silly behavior do an impression maybe and then hmm, maybe we can exchange numbers i wonder if they would like that um you okay girl you fine <laughs> are you serious he's calling in the middle of our date okay i need to challenge myself a new job might be the solution yeah sure follow your heart sweetheart i was actually so scared he would ask us on a date just now but i called you so i didn't have to decide myself oh i'm sorry i thought that was a, a nice reply but okay but you are supposed to decide for yourself what you want to do in life because i don't know what you're interested in akira you didn't have seven perfect dates so yeah sorry no money however this drama is gold and has skyrocketed our ratings so thanks um i'm glad 
that our dates meant something to you guys you freaking money grabbers um so yeah that basically means we failed that freaking date thing but we are gonna finish this date okay <gasps> he doesn't seem very happy though is does he sorry dude let's talk let's play some board games yeah let's do that let's do that um play together so um I see. Okay, it seemed like they didn't really have a good time together. I'm so sorry that had to happen, um, Jude. But anyway, I mean, that means we can go home now, you know, because this date was actually kind of awkward and weird and all that stuff. If I have to be honest, the dating system in this game is actually pretty hard, especially when the person that you're dating isn't really compatible with you, I noticed. Like, if the one is very romantic and you're a very romantic sim, then it goes well like with Akira and with Jokuin, but with Jesse and Jude, it just didn't go well at all, but it's cool. I like it that way. But all right, you beautiful people, I think I'm gonna leave this episode right here. You got the job, I'm so happy. But yeah, hopefully in the next part, we can maybe do, you know, something extra different. Maybe get into, you know, helping the ring bear some more. That would be great. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you all in the next one.